Hello everyone, my name is Elise. I am starting my own booktube channel. Um, here in the next week or so, I'm hoping to do a get to know you video. Um, and I also have a plan for a giveaway at 50 subscribers to give away my fairy loot special edition of A Curse So Dark and Lonely, which I'm planning to be one of my first book reviews for this channel. The first thing that I thought I would do, however, for my videos is today I have my limited edition copy from Fairy Loot of Girls of Smoke and Shadow that I pre-ordered. It took me a little bit longer to get it than a lot of the people who got it because I'm in the middle of a divorce right now and when I pre-ordered it I had it shipped to my ex-wife's house. She wasn't home when they delivered it and so they sent it to the local USPS office, but I had to get in contact with Fairy Loot. And anyways, I just got to pick it up today. So I'm really excited. So I wanted to go ahead and unbox that on camera with you guys. So here goes nothing. Here's the box. I haven't even looked at it yet. Um, I just have seen the pictures. I really loved the first book, um, Girls of Paper and Fire. The, you know, I just, I, I'm queer, you know, so I really love reading, um, Couple, couples in fantasy novels that are same sex or non-binary. Um, I have ordered um, Red, White, and Royal Blue from Book of the Month, which I've heard great things about and I'm really excited to read before the end of the year. So anyways, the, they always super tape things. It, it really... <laughs> normally I have a box cutter because I work at a grocery store, but I didn't think to bring one home today, so... Two layers of cardboard, well protected, which is good. This is the first one I've gotten from Fairy Loot that isn't part of a subscription box, so it's good to see that their individual books are also really protected. Not as much uh, confetti though, which is, you know, probably good. Uh, oh, there it is. It's got a nice little fold. Oh, it's just absolutely gorgeous. I love these teal edges, which coincidentally kind of match my hair. Didn't plan that, but you know, fun. Um, looks like that's Lee and Ren on the front. Um, so I'm really excited to get to read this. Um, I'm planning on starting A Curse So Dark and Lonely because that one was voted for as my next read on Twitter before I realized I was gonna be able to pick this up this week. Um, but I do plan on reading this before the end of the year. So hopefully we'll be able to talk about it more when I do my first um, it's already the start of December, so I don't know if I'm going to be able to do a TBR list, um, video, but I do want to do a wrap review as well as an end of the year review and books I look forward to in reading in 2020. So look forward to that. Um, and hopefully I get to meet and talk to some of you guys as I delve further into making videos. So thank you. Have a great day. Bye.